Hey guys, it's Shannon. Welcome back to another Quick Tip Tuesday. So I'm continuing this Silhouette Studio program series for everyone. Um, I have several videos out now that share with you some of the features that this program offers. And I will link that playlist down below if you'd like to go check that out after you're finished watching this video. And today I'm going to be covering how to in install fonts uh, into your Silhouette Studio program. So you could go up here to the store and download fonts from the Silhouette Studio store. However, you can also go on to different free font websites um, download them and install them and use them within Silhouette Studio. So that's what I'm going to share with you today. So before you get started, uh, you actually want to close out your Silhouette Studio program because you'll have to reload the program once your font is installed. So I'm going to click and close this. So we do not want to save that. We're going to come down here. Now I want to also share with you that this is for uh, Windows, I do not own a Mac. I've never used a Mac. I'm sure I would love a Mac if I had a Mac, but I don't. I actually use just a Dell laptop and it works great for me. I know how to use it and works just fine, especially with Silhouette Studio Program. So I just wanted to mention that. Um, I'm sure there's more uh, tutorials on YouTube that you could search to learn how to install these fonts and use them on a Mac. So. Now let's get back into downloading your font. This is a font that I use quite frequently on my channel. You'll see it used for the farmhouse style. It's very similar to the Ray Dunn font. And I have a lot of questions from uh, viewers who are asking where to get this font because it's not in the Silhouette Studio store. And no, it's not. It's actually on a website called dafont.com. So I've already loaded that up here. So you go to defont.com and type in this up here in the search the skinny and this is what will come up you can also google search the font, uh, the skinny font and it should take you right here here as well so once you have found the font on defont.com you come over here and click the download button now for me it's going to show up down here and then once it's done loading which mine is already um, installed so it's gonna give me a couple little prompts here but what you do is once it's downloaded you go into your file folder and there's a folder called download now you can see that the skinny font has been downloaded into my download folder and as you can see it's a zip folder so you actually have to extract this so what I do is I right click on the folder and then I hit extract all now I want to put my uh, font, I just usually always keep it in the download folder. So I backspace the name of the font, which was the skinny, back until it says downloads so that it'll go right back into the same folder I came out of. So once you have selected folder, you can also come over here to browse and click downloads or put it into whatever folder you want. I'm going to keep mine in my download folder. So then we'll hit extract. And then what it will do is it will extract the font out of the zip folder into these two different. So the skinny actually has a regular skinny and then a bolded skinny font. So what you do once you have this extracted is you will right click on each one and hit install. And what that does and now see this is prompting me because I've already installed this font. So I'm going to hit no, but it will ask you, do you want to install it? You'll hit yes, or it will auto install for you. And you want to come to this other one as well. If you want the bolded style, hit install. Obviously, I'm not going to replace it because it's the same thing, but it would install for you. And then what you'll do is you'll come, you'll, you'll exit out of your uh, task bars and you'll come back into your Silhouette Studio, reopen it. All right, so now that I have my program reopened, I'm just going to insert some font, which I have a video on this too, if you like to go check that out. So you just type in your font and then select it. And then up here in your font bar, you can type in the skinny 
and it will pop up for you. So let me turn it black so you can see it against the white background. And that is how you can install any font into the Silhouette program. So now that you know how to install fonts within your Silhouette Studio program, you can hit up all these great free font websites and install new fonts into your Silhouette program. The same way I showed you, hitting download, extracting the file, and then installing the fonts onto your computer, which will then open in Silhouette. So I can already see I want this one here, and I'm gonna download this one now. So uh, I hope that this tutorial has helped all of you. Make sure to take a second to give it a thumbs up. Also hit the subscribe button. I do DIY tutorials every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, and I've been uh, creating these Silhouette program tutorials for you on Tuesdays. And if you guys have any questions, leave them in the comments below. If you have any suggestions for any upcoming Quick Tip Tuesdays, you can leave those in the comments below as well. And I want to thank everyone for watching. I really do appreciate it. I will see you next time. Bye, guys.